Now we will discuss electron affinity. Now, for removal of an electron from an atom, just now we have studied that energy is required. But if we want to add one electron to the atom, what will happen? In that case, obviously, energy will be released. So what is electron affinity? Electron affinity is the amount of energy released when an electron is added to an isolated gaseous neutral atom leading to the formation of an Trains in electron affinity. 
across a period from left to right, electron affinity increases and down the group from top to bottom, electron affinity decreases. Now let us see why electron affinity increases across a period. When you are travelling from left to right, what happens? R decreases and Z increases. See, both these factors will favour the increase in electron affinity. So, electron affinity will increase. But remember, this will take place till group 17. Group 18 will have zero electron affinity because group 18 is having stable electronic configuration. Obviously, it will be reluctant to add or to pick up an additional electron. Now, down the group, let us see what happens. Down the group, electron affinity will decrease from top to bottom. What is the reason? Down the group, R will increase, Z will also increase. Again, the predominating factor will be R. So, when we are moving from top to bottom down the group, since R increases, so electron affinity will decrease. Both ionization potential and electron affinity increases from left to right across a period. And both of them will decrease from top to bottom down a group. Now group 17 is a group in the periodic table which will have maximum value of electron affinity. If you were asked to compare the electron affinity of fluorine, chlorine and bromine, we all of them belong to group 17. Now we know that from top to bottom down a group, electron affinity decreases. So, we expect the electron affinity of fluorine to be greater than that of chlorine. But, this is not right. Here we have an exception. Electron affinity of chlorine is more than that of electron affinity of fluorine. So remember this exception. Reason we will learn afterwards. This much for today. In our next class we will study about electronegativity and metallic as well as non-metallic character. Thank you very much.